What's going on YouTube? Geosnow right here. You should definitely update the iOS 17.6.1 that was released yesterday. Right now, there is an important privacy and security issue that was fixed in that version. We're going to get into that in a second. This video is brought to you by Tenorshare Reboot, a software that allows you to easily repair your iOS system if it's broken and it's no longer booting. Definitely check the program out in the link below. So iOS 17.6.1 is now out. It was released yesterday and it's available for all iOS 17 devices. And if you do check out my iOS signing setups page over here you can see that iOS 17.6.1 is signed as well as iOS 17.6. So why you should update the 17.6.1? Well this is the change log from the update if you go in settings and you search for the update. It says in here the update includes important bug fixes and addresses an issue that prevents enabling or disabling advanced data protection. So what is advanced data protection? Well this is part of iCloud and Apple does have a page in here explaining what this does and how to turn on advanced data protection but in a nutshell this essentially encrypts everything it's end-to-end -end encryption so to quote apple advanced data protection for icloud is an optional setting that offers apple's highest level of cloud data security and if you choose to enable advanced data protection the majority of your icloud data including icloud backups photos, notes, and more is protected using end-to-end -end encryption. No one else can access your end-to-end -end encrypted data, not even Apple, and this data remains secure even in case of a data breach in the cloud. So you should know that this is somewhat a response of multiple hacks over the years on iCloud. Many people had their photos and their data exposed after their iCloud account was hacked because it was not encrypted. Now, if you enable advanced data protection, even if they do get a breach into iCloud and hackers manage to find exploits for iCloud, they will not be able to retrieve the data. So definitely go ahead, update the 17.6.1, especially if you don't care about jailbreaking. If you do care about jailbreaking, stay away from it. But if you don't care about jailbreaking, you care about privacy and security of your device, go ahead and get the update right now. It's a small update, but it brings an important fix. Thank you for watching. I am Gios Now. Till the next time, peace out.